Ang ina bro, di pure pa ng lalo! Sorry for the puta. Guys, huwag niyong gagayain niya na, huwag kayong kapuri sa Brody kasi ang bagal niyan. Huwag gusto mo lang mauli eh. Dito na ako kayo guys. Ang bagal na ng Brody, papuri pa kayo. Kung flicker kayo, hindi kayo makakasolo. Guys, kung flicker kayo sa Brody, makakamicro kayo guys. Kung flicker kayo sa Brody, makakasolo kayo sa lane. Pero pag puri pa hindi. So kayo magdatang Brody, ang pangit. Damage kayo. Kaya kayo marksman, kayo bubuhat eh. Wow, I'm not a big fan of this purifying the Brody Vela. And because of that, you can already see the pressure that they've placed down on that gold lane, knowing that the Brody won't really have uh, any sort of disengage except for his second skill that can be countered a lot. One of the weaknesses for Brody is not being able to actually, you know. They shot the right amount of the damage for the torn apart memory and getting in range for that torn apart memory. So without the flicker, it does take away a lot of that early game to mid game pressure on this Brody. Much more item rather than the opponent, but look at that one! Three man fatal links, man. That's gonna be Troy who flickers out to safety. The purify has been placed down, but the flicker comes through! And that's the problem that we mentioned in the draft. When you go for the purify on the Brody, no flicker means that you're very susceptible to everyone else. Yes, you could escape from the Atlas, but that's about it. You don't go for that. You don't go for one battle spell for one dude unless you can really afford to. And in